Happy Friday, everyone. Welcome back to Chats with Chase. Here's today's tip. So let's say you received a part file from either a customer or a part supplier, but it's not exactly what you need. It came in with mounting holes either improperly placed, sized, or you just don't need them at all. Since it came from outside, it's not a SolidWorks part and doesn't have any features for you to edit. In this case, we have these holes that we don't want. What we'll do is just get rid of them completely so that we can add some later. First thing I want to do is head to the Surfaces tab. We might think of just going straight for the Delete Hole tool, but you can see that's grayed out. That's because this is a solid body right now, and the Delete Hole tool only works for surface bodies. So instead of that, we'll use the Delete Face tool. Out of these options down here, we want to just use plain delete. If we patched it or filled it, we would still have the holes there, which we don't want. I'll go ahead and select all interior faces of the holes in question, which includes the face at the bottom of the countersink. After accepting that, we see that this is now a surface body when it was previously a solid body. Now, I'll grab the delete hole tool. I'll use it and grab the open edges of those holes, and there should be four in total. Once we hit OK, it should be a closed surface body with no visible sign that there used to be any holes there. Now, as a final step, I'll use the Thicken tool just to create a solid from an enclosed volume, and we're all finished. Thanks for watching. Contact me if you have any questions, and have a nice weekend.